play my little league, so we don't have to pay for us lights and uh, water, because it's gonna make us pay $50,000 a year. Uh, I think it's really sad, though, that I have to be here to defend a child's program uh, against budget cuts, especially in this day and age of uh, rampant obesity, uh, kids watching too much TV and video games, uh, too much select baseball, too many parents pushing their kids to get better. We really need Little League in Austin. And if this budget cut happens, Balcone G Sports is going to go down. And if we go down, Little League in Central Texas is going to go down. Um, we have an operating budget of $60,000. If this budget cut happens and we have to pay 50,000 utilities, we can't make it. We don't have enough money. We are private, but we're also a nonprofit, and we don't have any extra money left over. If we do, we put it back into our complex. We consider ourselves to be a family. This is not just some line item. It's not just a youth program. It's about a bunch of kids, 500 in fact, and their parents, and our community and our family. A place to go every night to watch kids play baseball while the youngsters run around and play on the playground. Uh, while mom sits in the stands with her newborn watching her husband coach her son or daughter. This is really important to us. And $50,000 budget, 500 kids that we provide baseball to, that's just $100 a kid. And what position do you play? Um, anything. And so your fear is if some of these budget cuts go through, the Balcones Little League will have problems. Yeah, it won't be there no more. I've been on the board for 10 years. It's part of me and I hate to see it go away. My son, who is 17 now, played there for 10 years. He had a great experience, he's got lifelong friends, and I just hope that the future generation of kids that live in our community are gonna to get to have the same experience that he's had. Thank you. Uh, baseball pretty important to you? Mm -hmm. I got it, thank you, good luck. Okay. Hey.